Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I met and asked a few students during orientation at Nate and I find their stories to be interesting. Most of them are international students coming from the Philippines, India, Peru, and Thailand. One woman I interviewed is a mother with kids. The nature of my questions are usually why they chose Nate and how are they enjoying their stay in Canada so far. However, some of them went outside my normal interview questions and have gone a little bit political. I have a separate video about the issue in Edmonton housing and their opinions of why it's happening and how the government can help. Okay, well, welcome to Nate. We're so excited that you guys have a nice and so we'll just walk around the campus. Feel free to ask any questions at any time and we'll just get started on our tour. Ready? Yeah. And how about you? When did you arrive? Oh. Why did you pick Nate? Why didn't you go? One of the best. One of the best? <laughs> yeah, <Okay>. center. <laughs> <laughs> like you. Why do you pick Nate? <laughs> well, I tried McEwan actually. Ah, I tried McEwan. Kaya lang, uh, they don't offer um, online services. So uh, okay. they, they, they want us to, yeah, to go. Right? So I can't do that because I'm working full time at the same time. So. And I'm supporting myself for these studies. So <laughs> I'm supporting myself for these studies, so I can't really, you know. So I have to. So, how about you guys? Who's paying for your. <laughs> you paid for everything? Yeah, yeah, of course. What kind of business do you have? A homemade candy in the Philippines. Really? Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I have my own. You don't mind if I'm recording, right? Because I'm trying to yeah. put this in my blogs. Yeah. <laughs> 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 yes, so. Uh, Our English is, is not good. <laughs> it's okay. I don't mind. Um, so, is this your first time outside the country or? No, this is my second time. Oh. I'm in Taiwan and this Canada. What, what were you doing in Taiwan before? Work. Work too? Yeah. What do you do for work over there? Um, oh, we have plenty. International students, Anybody from, where else are people from outside of Edmonton? Who's Edmonton born? I'm not Edmonton born. Where else are people from? Philippines. Philippines? Yeah. India. Yeah. I was there. Philippines. Right here. <laughs> Anywhere else? Nigeria. Nigeria. Oh, Nigeria, really? Yeah. So, yung work mo sa, yung ano yung, excuse me, yung work na ginagawa mo sa Taiwan before, is it related to what you're no. taking up right now? No. no. Only business in the Philippines. Oh. That's why I get management. So, you're doing management? Yeah. Okay. So, why did you, why are you doing it here in uh, Edmonton. Why didn't you do it in the Philippines? Uh, 20 hours. Okay. So that's like doing it in the, in the weekends kind of thing. Not only in the weekends, on the weekdays also. As long as you do 20 hours. Yeah. <laughs> so have you visited the yung, ano, yung, uh, Ook's Life website? Ah, uh, uh, Ah, oh, yeah. Kasi yung okay. na kayo sa mga anong mga, ano mga ina na niyo? Philippines nag-join kayo sa Philippine Club? Ay, meron ba? May Philippine Club. Yes. Yeah, Philippine Club. Yeah, there's a lot of clubs that you can join. Yeah, my first winter here was really good. It's naka naka experience na ba kayo ng snow? No, but sa Taiwan, di ba mayroon? Yeah, pero sobrang lamig. Yeah. Na huli na tayo. So, uh, first year mo? First year and uh, first timer. First timer here in Canada talk. Yes. One one month. One month. So you came directly from the Philippines? Yes. Okay. Family. 
What were you doing before in the Philippines? Uh, I'm working at Asian Development Bank. Oh, so you're an accountant in the Philippines? Uh, I'm working in budget admin. I see. The question is, what did you pick, Nate? So right now you're living with your sister. Okay. Uh, that's, family. that's good. Mm -hmm. Family of workers. I see. Okay. So I finished two <laughs> two years na sa diploma. Diploma sa Northwest. So ngayon, I'm trying to pursue CPA. So, but that means four more years. Four more years. No, I'm not an accountant in the Philippines. How much? How much did you pay? 6,000 to process everything. You any you know, work permit? How much? I mean, study permit. Study and work. Oh my god! In the 6,000 is no! 10,000 is 1 million. I think so. Yes, yes. Indeed. 10,000 Canadian dollars is 400,000. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. So, yun yung kailangan. Show money, yun? show money? No! Show money is million, not only 4,000. Show money is 25,000 Canadian. No. Yeah. 1.5 at least. Yeah. So you need 30. For single applicant. Oh, I'm 1.4 single applicant. I'm going to give you 1.5. Really? Million. Where's ano did you get that money? How did uh, you... She's rich in the Philippines. That's oh. all. Thank you. Bow. Nice. So how are you? Why are you rich? The most richest in the Philippines. Why are you rich? 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 Explore the world. Yes. Deepa. Yeah. Did you go to school after high school? Yeah. I just turned 28. So I oh. kind of just waited until I decided what I wanted. Yeah. Did you just come here? Yeah. Uh, well, I arrived in 2008. Oh, nice. And uh, yes, I was actually, I actually took some accounting courses. Yeah. When I got my permanent residency. And then, uh, I kind of liked it, so now yeah. I'm, I'm trying to pursue a CPA, <laughs> but I don't know because I'm too, too old for that. Yeah, Good but we'll see. Awesome. We'll see. So, so this this is your second year, I'm guessing. Second semester, Se first year. First so. year. Oh. Yeah. Okay. And how did you like it so far? So far, so good. So far, so good. It was yeah, a little stressful, but I'm excited. <laughs> yeah. How was the experience for you on doing it online? Um, distracted. Yeah? Yeah. I'm really excited to actually do it in person because I think I'm going to absorb the material. You're distracted because of the kids? And yeah. I started going to the library to like do it towards the end because yeah. I just couldn't. I was like, if the kitchen was messy, I was I see. focused on other things. So I think this is better anyway. <laughs> oh, okay. oh, that's cool. Yeah, that is. Nice. <laughs> That's great. And you you can do more when you're attending. Exactly. Right? Right. Than doing it. Seems more like me time. Yeah. Like that. Like see, you have lots exactly, of activities yeah. that you can do. Yeah. It's part of your. Um, your tuition, so you don't have to pay, you just have your one card. Yeah. Uh, yeah, if you, what, what are your hours? Uh, so right now, Monday to Thursday, 6.45 a.m. to 8.45 p.m. And then Friday, 6.45 a.m. to 7 p.m. And then Saturday and Sunday is 10 to 4 right now. Okay, yeah. Okay. Open, 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 open. Basically, yeah. Like, yeah, six to, or seven to seven, basically, hey? Yeah. But if you scan, oh. It's right there. <laughs> well, I don't know. I just feel it. I just like, I don't know. I think it's a better way to go. I've been looking and just looking. 
includes all the job opportunities that there are for each different okay. each different degree. Okay. And that seems like the best option. And I'll push myself a little bit because that's something I never would have thought I would have done. Mm -hmm. But I'm ready. <laughs> so does that mean you're good in, in math? I did two good in math numbers. courses. If you would ask me a while ago, I would have said no, but mm -hmm. it's harder for me, but I can do it. Oh, okay. I think I got like maybe 86 in my Oh, that's good. Last that's year. actually good. Yeah. And then in business math, I think it was like 76. But okay, yes. That was yes. like my first math class in like eight years. So I was like, okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> it's possible. Yeah, that's actually good. Yeah. Do you like math? Well, not really, but I like accounting. That's yeah. what I'm majoring oh, okay. in. So, yeah. <laughs> I like the analytical side of it, you know, because yeah. I like ana analyzing things. Yeah. And uh, yeah. And the number, not so much, but it can be learned, you know what I mean? Exactly. Yes. Yeah. Test and stuff and yeah. the microphone. But yeah, I was able to do it all online. Because what happened uh, with us at Norquest, well, the first two semesters, what they did is they, you can write your test yeah. online. Because that's when, uh, you know, COVID ha was happening. Yeah. But then uh, they started asking us to come to school yeah. and uh, do our test. Write our test. Just in case, yeah. Because I, I think it's because... Uh, so this is called Fresh Express. Um, they also oh, help you mind with if I ask you some vehicle assistance. So let's say, um, You're gonna ask we have anything. a vehicle here and it's really cold and you go out and doesn't start. You can contact Protective Services. They will come and help you start your car, boost it, and get you going so you're not stranded on your own. So definitely have that neat alert up. Um, it's very helpful. But the actual physical building is just down there. So, so is this your first time in Canada? Yeah. yeah. You guys? This is first, first time. time. First time in Canada. How do you, how do you like it so far? Till now it is quite it's good, like I uh, met brilliant. some people over here and they are quite ni nice Excellent nature. Excellent people. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and wh why Nate though? Why, why didn't you apply anywhere else? Why Why did you pick See, Nate? Uh, while I was in India, I've heard that it is one of the prestigious colleges uh, over here. And that is why I thought that enrolling in such college would be a great opportunity for me. Mm -hmm. So is it your first time attending uh, yes. university? Yes. You've never done it? Uh, no. Uh, I have attended a prestigious college in India as well, mm -hmm. which is my home country. It is NIT Jalandhar. Oh. Yeah. And you're taking up the same business administration too? Or? No, I'm actually trying to change my field because actually engineering is one of the bases which I have <laughs> yeah. had taken, but yeah. I wanted to go into the business. Yeah. That. Well, that's actually what I heard uh, of people coming from India. They're mostly I engineers or scientists. Yeah, yeah. yeah I Actually, it is about trend. Like, some yeah. people want to become engineers, some people want to become business persons. Yeah, yeah. There are so many choices and everyone is free to choose as they want. But so, yes, I tried to change. So right now you are majoring in what? Counting or? No, management. Into, uh, Management. Yeah. So you're, you're thinking of switching. Yeah. Uh, they have these amazing turkey pepperoni sticks. Really? This is more buildings. I visited Norquest as well. It is not much better. Norquest is like two buildings. Yeah. It is nine. Mm -hmm. And it's more compact. Yeah. You can find everything in one building. Need station. Okay. <laughs> you're, you're doing this full time, right? For sure. Yeah, this course is full time. I will be working part time as well. Okay, wh where do you think you are going to work though? Do I'm you have anything like in mind? Pursue as a cashier because it allow, will allow me to meet other people. And the whole motive of getting into business is to have a customer base. Yeah, yeah. yeah that's that is all. Yeah, so like Walmart and... Yeah, yeah, I will definitely try. Have you noticed though at Walmart they don't have cashiers anymore? 
Yeah, Did you see the takeout counters? Self -checking, self -checking. Yeah, you had to do. Yes, every, I have tried yeah, all the cashiers are gone. They actually yeah. had to. You actually have to go to the yeah, yeah self checkout now. What do you think about that? I think it is actually good. Like people should actually can do self checkout, yeah. and it would reduce the burden on the cashier itself. Yeah, but somewhere it has like maybe eradicated the number of seats where where a cashier could be yeah. enrolled. Oh. What about the privacy though? Because I've been hearing a lot about privacy uh, concerns about this uh, new that technology. Is not much of a concern. Like, see, uh, everywhere there is a problem for privacy. It is up to you what you want to share or not. Their own business started. Um, yeah. My name is Ryan, what's your name? Uh, Renato. Renato. Yeah. You are from... Ecuador. Oh, okay. And your name is? Uh, yeah. Ryan, where are you from? I'm from the Philippines. Oh, Philippines. Yes. What is your program? I'm taking up uh, accounting right now. Ah, okay. You don't mind if I'm recording yeah. you, right? Mine is You don't mind if I'm recording you? I don't have a problem. Yeah, okay. So, when did you move here in Canada? Last uh, uh, Monday, I arrived. Last Monday. Really? Yeah. Wow, freshly, freshly uh, when arrived. Mm. Yeah. yeah. So how did you like it so far? Excuse me? How did you like it so far? Uh, how do you like this? Yeah. Ah, yes, I like You like the... Uh, yes, I like the city and the... The stay here so far? Yeah, I like the city and the college. How was the people you're meeting though? Uh, very friendly. Yeah. Uh, I, I feel very affordable to stay here. And have you been anywhere than Edmonton? You've been no. outside the country. No, it's my first time. Yeah. So you're just... Uh, yeah. So since Monday you arrived, you're just in Edmonton. You didn't go anywhere outside the no, city. No, only in Edmonton. I moved in downtown yeah. to where small. How was that though? You like it? Yeah, I like it. I like the city, like the transport. Yeah. I feel very secure. So, why did you choose Nate? Nate, uh, I was looking for a program uh, with uh, with uh, with management and marketing. And okay. I, I choose uh, between Sait and Nate. Uh, oh. Calgary, Sait yeah, and yeah, yeah. Yeah. But uh, I prefer to, uh, to select uh, Nate uh, with the, uh, by the city because okay. it's more cheap than Calgary. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Yes, that makes sense. So you're not right now. You're taking a which? What, what are you majoring right now? Are you taking up accounting or? Oh no, uh, manager. Management. Yeah, so management. Taking, why management? Though? Uh, because in my original country, I, I, I worked in a, in a field similar oh, okay. and I would like to improve my, my knowledge mm -hmm. and my capabilities and abilities to, to manage resources. Yeah. And you are on a work permit right now, right? Yes. I think. And are you planning of staying uh, in Canada after you graduate? I, I am thinking. Yeah, yeah, I'm thinking. First, I, w I want to know the culture, the, mm -hmm. the, the, the environment of jobs, the vacancy, mm -hmm. and after I will decide. Yeah. There's a lot of, uh, you know, Latin areas in here, like, you know. Uh, yeah, I... Even in this, in the, in this campus, they have, uh, I think, a Latin uh, club. The chicken ah, yeah. apply, yeah. Yeah, I, yeah. I, I will. you go to the oopslife.ca, their website, oh, the okay. Life, you can find a Latin. I will review. Yeah, I will review. Yes, yes. Yeah. This, yeah, I think there was a. Do you dance too? Or? Yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm, I'm asking you these questions, but yes. They, I think they have a Latin dance club in the ah, campus. Yes. I will review it. I would like to, get to join you, but yeah, if I have time, yes. So you're doing it um, in person? This The courses you're doing in person or you're doing it online? Excuse me? Are you doing the courses in person or...? Yeah, in person. In person, in person okay. yeah. Some, sub some subjects uh, I will take uh, online. Okay, okay. Yeah, hybrid. So why do you think you want to do some courses online? Uh, because uh, uh, because I, I have the work permit. 
okay. I will try to to work and combine the work. studies and depend depend on the work, the kind, the type of the work. Yeah. Okay. So right now you're looking for a part-time job. Yes, I am looking uh, okay. for a part-time part job. Are you looking something in particular or? Uh, no, I, I don't look in particular. Uh, I, I like the simple change. I like and I prefer to to look yeah, yeah. Marshall, okay. Amazon, like this. Uh, but I don't have preference. preference. Well, thank you for your time, Renato, right? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, my name is Ryan again, sorry. Right. <laughs> yes, thank okay. you for your time. <laughs> so, why did you come here in Canada? Yeah, I want to move out from Thailand due to the political issues in Thailand. Oh. And then I never been outside of Thailand or Asian before for that matter. So, I want to get outside and learn new con new culture. Really? And try to survive on my own. Okay, yeah. so you're by yourself here yeah. right now. Yeah. So, you're here with a work permit or I mean study, study permit? The study permit, and, only. Uh, only, okay. only, yeah. But you can also work at the same time, right? Yeah, uh, but not over than 20 hours per week. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, because I'm, I'm a full-time student oh, here. Just, okay, yeah. okay. So, uh, are you planning of uh, continuing your education here in, at Nate or? Yes, uh, I just... It's this just my second this term. This is your sec second year? Yeah, second term. Second term. term. Okay. My first year. Are you still doing your orientation? Yeah. Oh, oh interesting. I have to do volunteering, yeah, because really? I want to get to know people. Oh, that's nice. That's yeah. awesome. That's good. Yeah. Yeah, you can do it. I think that's the best way to, do, yeah. Yeah, to, learn, to know more people. Like yeah. This, yes. So uh, you are taking a what you are majoring in what? A bachelor of technology. Okay. Okay. And Actually, what is that? About? Is the degree that you are continue from the another major like if you have like technology like engineering for example, I got like another bachelor from engineering back from my home country really? and then I continue here so okay. I got another degree from NEET. Wow, that's nice. Yes, so the work that I'm gonna do after I'm graduated, I think it's like project manager or some sort of okay, manager. Okay. Yeah. okay, so your line of work would be uh, uh, at oil and gas kind of thing? Probably, or IT yeah. companies. IT companies. Yeah. So, at, in Thailand, what, have, what, what did you do at Thailand? Programmer. I was okay, a you were a programmer. Yes. Mm. Developer. That's nice. Yeah. Thank you. Wow. It's not nice. It's like make my hair falling a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. No, that's good. Actually, I, I, I graduated computer programming back home in the Philippines, but that was a long time ago, and I was taking up a really old program. Like I was taking, I took up, uh, Cobol. Oh. A really, really so old. Long. Program. So So long ago. So I'm, yeah, I'm that old now. So, um, uh, why did you pick Nate? Um, because some of my friends, they told me like Nate and Alberta is the great place to start in Canada. Mm -hmm. And Alberta, they only like 5% tax, right? Yes. Yeah, so that's great. Like for a poor student to start a new, like that's great. But you know that the 5% tax is only the GST. Yes. No provision. Pro, pro no. PST, right? No PST. But what about when it comes to uh, filing your taxes at the end of the year? Do you know anything about that? Have you, have you filed your taxes? So Not many? yet, because I just started a job, so I, I, I never filed a tax year yet. Not yet. Yeah. Probably next year. Probably. Okay, okay. So, uh, how was your stay here in uh, Canada so far? Great. Yeah? is my expectation. Oh, that's good. Yeah. That's good. Have you been anywhere else than Edmonton? Like, you, have you been outside? Like, did okay. You go? Uh, before I came here, I went to Vancouver first okay, okay. to just travel before the term start, yeah. and then I just come here. It's like Vancouver is a great place, a lot of people. But then Alberta is not like more peaceful, hmm, in my nice. opinion. That's good. Yeah. That's good to hear. So, uh. What about have you have you been uh, 
Your so. friend? <laughs> no, he's not. She's not. But she's Filipino too, so she's oh. probably like, oh, she's Filipino, maybe she's. I'm not Filipino, but. No, that's you... okay. Oh, yeah, okay. thank you. Yeah, you know, I like multiculturalism. That's why I'm here in Canada, right? Yeah. That's what we are. Me too. For, yes. So my question was uh, uh, Have you heard anything about bad reputation um, when it comes to transportation here in Canada, especially in Edmonton? Mm, just homeless people. Just that? Just that. What do you think about that? Every country has their own problem, I guess. Mm -hmm. So this is one of here. Yes. But I guess it's not that bad, I guess. It's I want to say of oh. that. Okay, go ahead. Like I said, there will be a separate video about my interview with Nat about her opinion regarding homelessness in Edmonton and how the government can help. I hope you find this video interesting and we appreciate your support for our channel. Please like, subscribe, share, and leave a comment for more videos. See you all in our next video. Bye!